Good morning, TK friends. It's Mrs. Moores and Honey, and we are going to do a little drawing and writing lesson this morning. So you'll need a piece of paper and something to write with and something to color with. So let's get started. Let's see. Um, I know it's springtime, and in springtime, we see lots of bunnies around. It might be the Easter bunny, might be a little fluffy bunny outside. So today we're gonna draw and write about bunnies. Um, we're gonna start right here. And for our sentence, we're gonna use some of our sight words. So I think we should write today, I see a pink bunny. I'm gonna draw a pink bunny. If you wanna choose another color word, you can do that. So first things first, you can write your name on your paper. Then we're gonna start all the way at the bottom where our sentence will be. And I'm gonna write a capital I for I, straight line down. There's my capital I. Next, the next word will be C, our sight word, S-E-E. -E. So I'm gonna do a finger space, space between our two words, S, E, E, I, C, I'm gonna have another space and write the word A, our site word A. A, I, C, A. And do you remember what color I said my bunny will be? Pink, pa, pa. So I'm gonna write the word pink, P, remember, He's gonna go down to the worm line. I, n, 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 k, k, k. I see a pink. Now boys and girls, if you are gonna draw a blue bunny, you can write the word blue. A yellow bunny, you could write yellow. But if you're gonna do pink like me, here's how we spell pink. I see a pink. I'm gonna go all the way down here to write my word bunny. Everybody say bunny, bunny. Now let's sound bunny. B, uh, e, bunny. I heard the first sound is b, b, b. Then I heard the sound uh. That's right, that's a u. N, and it's not just one n, it's N N bunny. And at the end of bunny, it's a Y that says E. I see a pink bunny. And at the end of our sentence, what happens, boys and girls? <gasps> That's right, period stop. Okay. Perfect. I hope you wrote your nice sentence just like me. And now we can take uh, our color. You can do this in pencil if you want and then color it after. But now I'm gonna show you how to draw a bunny. You're gonna start down here on, on the line. Okay, and you're gonna go up around and down. See, I went part way up, not all the way up. And this is gonna be your bunny's body, okay? Now the next part is right in the middle. You're gonna draw a circle and color that in. That will be our bunny's nose, okay? Then you're gonna do two ovals for eyes. I think it's starting to look a little bit like a ghost. <laughs> I'm gonna color those in partially. Hello, bunny. <laughs> Starting to look cute. She's gonna get two ears. Okay, so I went up on one side and then back down. And I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. Up on this side and then back down. Okay, so there's my bunny's ears. Then, from the little bunny nose, we're gonna draw two little teeth. 
<laughs> Isn't she looking cute? And then she needs some whiskers. I did three, one, two, three, and then three on the side. One, two, three. Okay, and then she's gonna get a little bunny tummy. <laughs> you can color in, I know some of the honeybees love to do this. They love to color in part, part of the ears. Okay. And this is our bunny. If you wanna draw around your bunny, you can draw the sky or the sun. You know what? I think I forgot an important part of my little bunny. Oh, there's her little cotton tail. <laughs> if you wanna draw grass at the bottom, I would love to see that. And you know what? Honeybees and sea turtles, if you want to send me a picture of your bunny, I would love that. I would absolutely love that. Okay, I hope your bunny is looking beautiful and I hope to see it later. I miss you all and I love you. Bye.